I popped my shit. I popped it. I'm talking about was enjoying myself. I'm enjoying my first year of being out of jail. I'm popping it. You know, if you see me fighting the bird, help the bird. <laughs> don't help me. I don't need you niggas, man. Help the bell. I'm popping it. All of a sudden, I say, hey, let me do it for the ladies before I roll. Listen, let me tell you some cold bloody shit. I ain't even foes to perform this song. I don't even foes to be performing this song. I did it just because they were showing me so much love. They were showing me, so I said, man, let me let me do it for the for the ladies one time. So I boom, I jump off stage, I sit on the speaker, I get in P mode. You know what I'm saying? I sit on the speaker. So my little brother right next to me, it's the honest God truth, y'all. My little brother right next to me. Tay Tay, Tay G. So he tell the owner, like, listen, I'm finesse, man. Nigga walk around with three, four hundred thousand dollars worth of jewelry on. So I'm tell so when my when I'm in the public, my people is around me, not people we don't know. Niggas don't understand I done had hits put on me. I got niggas that don't like me. I got niggas that envy me. I got niggas that hate me. I got niggas that, 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 that's jealous. I got niggas that, so I don't want nobody around me. I don't know. What the fuck is wrong with you promoter ass niggas? With you club jumping ass niggas? Y'all ain't understanding this shit? I am on federal probation. Some you niggas don't know about. You six to nine months doing ass niggas. You lame ass niggas. I'm talking about real charges, aggravated, no misdemeanors, you lame-ass niggas, man. And playing with my freedom and my life. And all I'm trying to do is give me some money, man. And raise my kids to be different than I was and you nigga playing. And I'm telling, I done went live about this shit two, three, four times. Currently telling motherfuckers, hey, man, make sure everything lined up, man. Make sure I got somewhere to park it. Make sure the cl the stage clear. Make sure this. Make sure that. I'm going to come and do what you asking me to do. I'm going to do everything that you asking of me. All I'm asking of you is to help me help you. Help me help you. What the fuck? I can't do this shit by myself. You have to help me help you, nigga. But get what? When I pull up to the clubs. The promoter drunk. And yeah, for next, what going on? Yeah, let me take a picture. Man, get your muck ass off the side, man. I came here to handle my business. Let's take a picture on the inside, man. What the fuck your muck ass right here about to sprint for? I'm on federal probation. Nigga get the popping right now. Guess what? Get what? If my probation officer feel like they want to call me and say, hey, you can't do no more shows. Now I can't even get no money to feed my little ones. But you bitch ass niggas going to continue to eat though. So when I pull up and I jump out of you niggas on this, all this, oh, let's take, man, I'm trying to get in, get to my section, have me a few shots, kick it, go do my set, do what I'm supposed to do, take her my business. And go home. And make it back to my little bitter ones. But then here come you niggas. Being extra for some money. And I understand. I get it. Don't no nigga give a fuck about me. Don't no nigga give a fuck if I'm free or not. Don't no nigga give a fuck if I'm dead or not. When I die like niggas gon' niggas gon' niggas gon' niggas gon' praise, nigga gon' say. R.I.P. this, then the third, three, four, five, six days, and then it's over. You know. You know. I'm a realist, though. I understand it. I get it. So the world go around. 
just life. That's just what I got to deal with. You know, and I ain't even asked to be on this earth, but I'm here and it is what it is. I'm going to set what come with this shit. But while I'm here, I'm going to be the best motherfucking man, the best motherfucking daddy, the best motherfucking friend, the best motherfucking CEO. I'm going to be the best motherfucker I can be while I'm here. You know, everybody live to die. We all live to die. I get it. So I ain't tripping death. But if I can hip it, if I can hip it, now the inevitable, I can't stop. But if I can hip it, I am. If I know, if I go left, I'm all right. But if I go right, I'm fucked. I'm going to for sure go left. You see what I'm saying? You know, I book myself. Dude didn't book me. Dude didn't book me. He ain't had no $50,000 to book me. He ain't had no $50,000, $60,000 to book me. I book myself. I rented that club out. I'm the one rented that club out. Me. He kept all that old stealing shit, all that. True enough. I supposed to gave him a certain percentage. But guess what? Back to the story. Get my cup right here on. Where am I cup right here? Back to the story. So I sit down on the speaker. I'm finna pop it. I got two, three bad bitches in front of me. We finna have a cabin, no top jacuzzi party, private after party. We finna do it, do it. I'm on it, do it, fluid. <laughs> I'm on it, do it, fluid. You hear me? So I'm like, okay, we finna. So I got three, four of them. I'm like, okay. I sit down. I'm like, oh, I'm finna mac these hoes. I get the mac. I get the mac. Next thing you know, my little brother, I hear my little brother ran with a nigga. He like, no, bro, you can't stand right here. You got to go around. And he like, I'm the owner of the club, so I'm still popping it, but I'm hearing what's going on. So I'm like, so some tell me to just look. So when I look, he trained his eyes on me and said, nigga, this my club. When he said that, I jumped up. When I jumped up, you know what happened when CEO jump up? When CEO jump up, shit. It go left. I, I hate it for anybody who was hurt, any women, any men, but if you was a police-ass nigga, or if you was a, one of the bitch-ass niggas who tried to help him, or anything, fuck you. Fuck you. I don't give a fuck, bitch. Die. I don't give a fuck, bitch. Fuck you. Fuck you. Because get what? It could have been yo, you who stopped me from making it home to my family. I'm the one who had to swallow my pride and get up under the stage and crawl out the tent to my motherfucking bulletproof truck. I'm the one who had to do that. I'm the one that had to go through all my whole motherfucking team being investigated because this lame ass promoter nigga who think he having some motion and having some money, broke ass nigga wanna stand beside me and bit me intoxicated. Bruh, you intoxicated, bruh? What is you even doing running a business right now? You can't even run a business properly intoxicated. What is you standing by me trying to reach at me and tell what you want to be by me for? I ain't that. Respectfully. I don't move that. So what you around me? What is you doing? We ain't friends, nigga. What the fuck you trying to put your hands around my neck for? Nigga, I don't know you. I don't know you, nigga. Nigga, we met doing business, bitch. That ain't mean I'm trying to feel on you, nigga. No, you, nigga, you ain't big A. Don't touch my neck, pussy. 
Maggie? You trying to be cool. You want to look cool in front of your city. Man, get your muck ass away from me, nigga. Try and look cool. Man, get your dick eating ass away from me, man. You up real yeah, trying to get by, nigga. Man, get your bitch ass away from me, man. You ain't spent no money, man. I rented this shit out, nigga. That's my money at the door, nigga. You ain't spent shit, nigga. So what the fuck is you up on me for? This is what you got your ass knocked out for. For being up on a nigga. So all that old shit they time out. A nigga did him something. He got knocked out for a reason. And that far as the shooting, I don't know nothing about that. I couldn't tell you. I don't know. I plead the fifth. Get me a lawyer. <laughs> but hey. That promoter. He was dead wrong. The owner, not the promoter. The owner, the nigga with the dread, little small nigga. The nigga got scratched out. He was on the cross like Jesus. That nigga was there on the cross like Jesus. Hey, look. Next, man, bless them. And so you know, Jew been scratching anyway. He been trying to bless something. Like, and then this nigga picked today. Man, you don't know. See, see, this what. Where, where, where society go wrong it, they feel like since we rappers and we got money and jewelry and we able to get us some car and some clothes that everything good. Bitch, we stress too. Bitch, we go through it too. You feel what I'm saying though? Am I right or wrong, bro? Most definitely. You know, and um, shit happened, and I got the fuck on. I got the fuck out of it. 